Join us as we take a break from working on the cars for another pedal box road trip. We went to Chester Cathedral for the last running day of Pete Waterman's Making Tracks 2 exhibition, featuring a 64-foot layout in double O gauge of the West Coast Main Line. Depicting elements between Hillmorton Junction, just west of Rugby in Warwickshire, where the track must climb over a grade on a viaduct to reach Coventry and Birmingham over the lines which go towards Tamworth and Wolverhampton. Between these two points, the track meets multiple road bridges above the catenary and crosses over yet more roads and the Oxford Canal as it makes its way through the landscape. The whole scene has been superbly modelled in double O and condensed down from its seven mile span to just under one scale mile. A layout of this size has a number of unique benefits over what most can fit in a home layout. Most notably, the length of trains which can be accommodated within the scene in their entirety. There are some great viewing angles of the layout, particularly of the flyover at Hillmorton Junction, and a really good mix of rolling stock and locos, mostly from the post-privatisation era, and a few outliers like this steam-pulled rake of wagons that really felt like it went on forever snaking along the track. The audio in the cathedral wasn't the best, the sound of the trains was often quite overwhelmed, so for this video I chose to find as much audio as I possibly could and overlaid that on top of the footage. Hopefully you'll enjoy this video, let us know what you think in the comments.
If you'd like to support the channel, you can go to shop.pedalbox.show where you can buy our merch, our stickers and more. And if you'd like to support us directly, you can go to patreon.com forward slash pedalboxshow where you can support us from as little as a dollar a month. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you on the next episode.